Hi and welcome back to a singles functions video here. Although there's probably going to be more than one function, we're going to talk about how to transpose a track and how to change the key signature. But before I start, like, subscribe, don't forget to leave a comment on the video, hit the notification bell. And uh, it's come to my attention that 93.7% of people watching my channel are not subscribed. Just click on the subscribe button, it does help grow the channel and uh, even leave some comments and likes and stuff will be appreciated. Thanks. Anyway, so let's jump straight in. As you can see here, you've got the key signature that shows here. And this song by Billie Eilish is in E minor. Okay, so if we open up this, you can see the uh, chords here. Okay, it's quite basic chords. Now, if we put the score on, you can see the actual chords and what key they're in, right? Here you can see that's in E minor. Now, to change the whole key of the song, uh, you need to go to global tracks here, open them up, and then make sure that you've got transpose by right-clicking into this space here and then choosing what you want. So we've got key signature and we've got the transpose as well, okay? So this is in E minor. Now, I've taken the vocals out for copyright issues. You never know, they might block the video for that. So you can hear it's playing here in E minor. Now, let's take it up, uh, say, two. And it will change the whole track, huh? so you know, if you've got the bass as, as well, or the MIDI pass. Back to normal. Okay, so let's say you want to take it up two steps. So this is now going to be going up from E minor to F sharp minor, okay, going up a whole tone. Now here it still stays the same though. So what that means is if you double click here and you're in score, you're still going to see the key signature. So you need to change this key signature up. So what you need to do is you go here and then you want to put that in F sharp minor, okay. Then here you can see that's changed and here it's changed here as well. And so that will give you the correct score for the actual transpose that you've done. So there you have it, how to transpose and change the key signature in the score of a song. I hope that was useful for you. If it was, like, subscribe, and I will see you soon. Ciao.